Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Space Marine 2 with me, Regaton. Let's break here for the Chiron. There we go. Back to the walk with you. There aren't headdresses that throw me off. Hang in there, buddy. Right, good job, Chiron. Get to Chiron now. But did not die, buddy. Oh wait, is that a guardian relic? Sergeant, check the perimeter. Yes, brother. Explain yourself. Need I justify my hatred? You need justify your recklessness. The traitors have a debt to me, and you will throw away your life to collect. Death is my duty. Your duty is to the Emperor. You will die when and where he so chooses, not over some personal vendetta. Do you understand? Lieutenant, you should see this. Oh, Statue St. Gwydius. That's really cool. Those must be in there. They're using some kind of shield. The altars. Same ones we encountered earlier. They must generate the shield. Destroy them. Then purge these abominations from the face of this world. It seems the traitor's motives are unmasked. Seems. You doubt they wish to stop Aurora. You will soon learn that when dealing with heretics, nothing is as it seems. They cried out my name, but I stayed hidden. My position, my rank, my life is worth more than theirs. 
I am of the Adeptus Administratum. I am of the Departmento Executor. I pay for the war. I am instrumental. I pass on the tides. I open the purse that keeps our defense guns charged. Oh, they told the cultists where I'm hiding. A well, plasma incinerator. Delta rifle. Uh, let's give this a whirl. They will not get past this. It's got a small arc to it. So it takes a little more finesse. Get a little roughed up. Let's go and pop this. I'll take that. Chiron, you better back up, buddy. must be stopped. Why? The artifact we saw in those classified files may be of chaos origin. Why wasn't it destroyed? It is immensely powerful. They believe they can control it. And you're just gonna hand it over to Luz? Let it continue? These are my orders. Yeah. Poor Titus. Keeps getting thrown in these situations. Just got back and he's at it again. What are they doing? It matters not. Kill them. Let us tear off their lips. close there. Area secure. Now the altar. All right, but what's up here first? Yeah, I think the uh, sniper rifle will be better against these guys since they can snagger. Snagger? <laughs> Snagger the Thousand Sons. Grabbing equipment. I don't know if this is going to be worth using. We'll try. to breach the doors. That is no simple sorcery. Look how twisted the altar has grown. It seems alive. If it lives, then let us teach it of pain and death. Yeah, we'll summon there in just a moment. Let's see what resources we have available before I start. Restocking. 
Not a whole lot. I think we're gonna fight that chaos sorcerer that we saw. It reeks of the warp. Raise the armor of your contempt and snuff it out. Look! It shrinks from us! Then keep close and endure. We must disrupt the spell. The heretics sent such a meager force to meet us. Show them the error of their ways. I know I was gonna go down there. I was just trying to finish off the one guy before I did. I do appreciate the detail where we can just sprint through guardsmen. And they explode. Oopsies. Yeah, it feels like my like current main weapon just doesn't have the kick it needs. So I'm going to keep this one equipped. They are attempting to breach the doors. This one has AoE. It'll be better against the groups of guardsmen that spawn. Look how twisted the altar has grown. It seems alive. If it lives, then let us teach it of pain and death. So is the death counter at 10? Loading up. I wanted to keep track, but I've been doing a very poor job. Uh, it reeks of the warp. Raise the armor of your contempt and snuff it out. Look! It shrinks from us. Then keep close and endure. We must disrupt the spell. The heretics sent such a meager force to meet us. Show them the error of their ways.
Well, we're doing okay, I think. Good to stop that. That could be worse. I wouldn't mind if they counted towards this uh, timer as well. They keep walking through if the uh, percentage doesn't go up. Yeah, play defensively is the better strategy. You don't want to go all out because you'll get melted. You want to sit back and parry. I keep trying to run in. Thanks, Chiron. Yo, all of you. I'll take this. 
Oh, I want this one too. I don't know why he wasted his ability on that guy. <laughs> I guess my execution did more damage. Special tactics. The altar is vulnerable. Destroy it. I kind of wish these guys had different classes. Lieutenant Titus the Lance of Jove, status report. We are patched up and on our way. See you at the objective. The Emperor protects. So they have the same weapon. I mean, they have different abilities, but the same weapon. I wish one was like a bulwark and another Lance was a Job. attical or something. Stand by for extraction. In the name of the Emperor, open the doors! If they can. It's a welded shut. Morius Luce. I owe you my existence. Come with us. To where? The battle barge. Compliance, but I must speak with Archmagus Nozick at once. He's dead. Dead? You are to replace him. Uh, Lose. the Mechanicus meddle with the unknown? We follow the will of the Omnisire. Go ahead. Titus, report to Captain Acheron immediately on arrival. Confirmed. Titus? A Captain Titus was killed on the forge world of Graia over a century ago. He died holding the power source in his hands. Not even an, an Astartes could survive power of that magnitude. Morius Luz, come with me. We must report to Captain Acheron. Plug those Promethean links immediately. Minister in maintenance. I will need a repair crew before my next flight. Yes, sir. 
Take note of the battle damage for the engine seers. Armor plating in sections 28B and 40E is compromised along with void seals. Portside aileron is jammed. Portside afterburner has shrapnel lodged inside. Pressure test the fuel system after the leaks are sealed. Heavy bolters require a full resupply. Short range sensors have been rendered useless. Make that a priority. I'll make the necessary arrangements, my lord. Every small task is its own meditation on glory. What was that between you and Luz? Irrelevant. I disagree. That is your right. Brother, we only want to help you. Help? You almost cost us the mission, and now you speak of help. Alright, I'm not going to get involved with that. We've inspected and certified Melter Rifle Crate 06.77C. I want to share an elevator with these guys. Stretched by the Tyranids. The traitors have us off guard. The Adeptus Mechanicus tell me Aurora is ready. They say the weapon will work. Sir, I know your concerns, Titus, but we may have no choice. Can we at least warn Kalgar of the danger? Impossible. The astropathic relay on Avarax has been completely surrounded. Every attempt we've made to break through the Tyranid lines has failed. Can we Vox a message in? There's a dead zone around the relay. Something's interfering with our Vox comms. We have to get inside. Emperor, save me. I've tried. Now the Tyranids have launched an attack on our defenses. We're pulling back to the fortress. We'll make our final stand there. Battlefield projection. Magnify C3. Where are you? There. The Hive Tyrant. We've had no reports. It's there. We kill it. We break the synaptic connection. It scatter like rats. The Hive Tyrant. A worthy adversary. And if you're wrong, if it's not there, I cannot afford to throw men after a hunch. Give me two squads. Two squads? We need to kill the Hive Tyrant, find whoever is jamming us, and get the message inside the relay. Six men. That's all I can spare. Use them wisely. Thank you. The Emperor protects. Buddy, listen. Lieutenant Titus. Receiving. Attend me on the crew deck. Acknowledged. Titus wasn't the Death Watch. I mean, that's part of the reason they send Marines to the Death Watch, is to get. Experience fighting Xenos. Yeah, this honor guard looks so cool.
I don't think you can get that shield in the multiplayer. You can play as a bulwark and use a shield, but it's like the same looking shield no matter what you look like. Which is kind of lame. It'd be hilarious if the chaplain ended up being Leandros, because I'm assuming he's going to make an appearance in this game. The only other prevalent character, besides our squad members, the B team that you play in operations, and Akron is the chaplain. I will take full responsibility. I gave no report. I have yet to decide if you require formal penance. The arch enemy lurks in the shadows of the Hive City. Jericus was blindsided by a rubric Astartes. He slayed the enemy but lost his left hand. Those abominations stir a deep wrath within me, brother. Indeed. The cowards sent empty vessels to face us. There is hardly satisfaction in slaying vacant ceramite that does not lament its folly. Give us heretic flesh that we may settle old scores. Ultramarines and uh, Thousand Suns didn't have a specific rivalry. Well, I could change my armor to a space wolf. <laughs> Give the uh, Thousand Suns a sequel to Prospero Burns. Varelis always did put his brothers before himself. He once shielded me from a Tau ambush. Rail rifle nearly took his arm off along with half my helmet. The one degree of deflection saved my life. We only had to mourn his pauldron that day. The Emperor will remember his valor longer after we join him. Forgive me, brother. to Lord Kalkar may determine the course of this war. Choose your words wisely. You doubt my intentions. It is your actions I will judge. I need not remind you of the consequences you suffered the last time. If you cannot trust in the will of the Primarch, then you are unfit for this duty. It's okay, it's I am not the only one on this ship with concerns about your intentions. It is the chaplain's responsibility to ensure our chapter remains pure. I was about to touch yours. on this. Your erratic behavior is plain for all to see. And now, I find you have a history of it. I am doing my duty, as I was then, protecting a system from ruin. The chaplains ensure the chapters remain pure, and they also are responsible for the spiritual well-being of the chapter. Now, some chaplains in different chapters do have slightly different responsibilities, but that's the gist of it. Oh, give me a thunder hammer, man. Ah, oh, there he is. Lieutenant, Gallio and I were just examining your recent diagnostic. Gallio, I object to such intrusions. As do I. But they are queries I must fulfill. I seek only answers. Your survival is a profound mystery that must be resolved. 
Such unbridled curiosity is the gateway to ruin. But that is where you are mistaken. Ruin is all around us, but I will soon depart for the Aurora facility on the Merium, and there I shall close all gateways to ruin permanently. You will see. Hmm. just want this. I don't think I'm asking a lot. Just give me the hammer. There's our boys. Status report. Hangar deck optimized for Thunderhawk and battle tank priority deployment, sir. All hangar personnel assigned to priority one task, sir. Maintenance checks performed on all vehicles. Repairs underway, sir. Battle tank armaments and ammunition checks complete, sir. All functional battle tanks refueled and ready to go, sir. Good. Inform the pilots of all vehicles that are ready for deployment. Dismissed. Lieutenant, the squad is ready. We are yours to command, Lieutenant. The astropathic relay on Abarax is under direct assault. If it falls, so do our hopes of reinforcement. We will engage in a three-point operation to break the Xenos command, restore Vox, and secure the relay. We will not fail you. Not one of us can afford to fail this day. Prepare for deployment. I will transmit mission details on descent. Alright, so we've got our heavy, we've got our assault, uh, he is the bulwark, uh, he's the vanguard, scout, and tactical. It's a cool name. Uh, the Adeptus Mechanicus insists on deploying Aurora, despite the potential dangers posed by its power source. The Ultramarines must stand ready to respond should its latent threat manifest. Transmit a warning to Chapter Master Marnaeus Calgar. Mission objectives ask, access the astropathic relay, and send a message to Lord Calgar. Hey, I saw the quote down there. That's the uh, librarian from Dawn of War 1. Isidore. facing the Hive Tyrant. Talasa can handle it. They have three men. We should be with them, but you have us playing courier. That message has to get through. And what exactly is that message? Speak your mind, brother. I searched the archives. You were once captain of the second company, and then you disappeared. Over a century ago, I was serving with the Death Watch. There would be records. 
Not for a black shield. A black shield? You would erase your chapter markings. I would die for these colors. Then why? I was accused. It was my penance. What were you accused of? Corruption. Brace for landing. So I brought the sniper along in case we fight Thousand Suns, which I'm sure we will. That I can actually stagger them and hit the upper hand. But I'm going to call it here for now. Next time we'll proceed towards the uh, Astropathic Choir. This is pretty cool. But either way for now, thanks for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next one.